We're going to look at how to save some of your custom stamped patterns, motifs, or stitch patterns in the Generations program. You need to do this prior to installing version 2 only if you have created custom files you wish to keep. Locate the C drive on your computer. Once you've located the C drive, you're going to scroll down until you find the SuperTech folder. Double left click to open the SuperTech folder. In the SuperTech folder is the Generations folder, and I'm going to issue a word of caution. Prior to just copying any folder, please remember that the structure of version 2.0 is distinctly different and copying any program folders or files from your previous versions into Generations 2.0 will cause your system to not work properly. You can, however, copy stamped patterns, your building blocks, motifs, or any pattern files you've created. Double left click on the Generations folder to open it. The structure of specific folders has not changed, which allows you to keep your custom files. You can select your motif folder, your pattern folder, and your stamped pattern folder to copy and place back into 2.0 if you've created custom files. If you only need to copy one folder, just simply left click on it and then right click on it and select copy. If you need to copy multiple folders, left click on the first folder, hold the control key on your keyboard, and left click on your pattern or stamped pattern folder. Then right click and select copy from the drop down menu. Paste these files into a location where you'll be able to locate them, such as your documents or your desktop. To paste them, just simply find a blank spot and right click and select paste. These folders will now be pasted onto your desktop. After you've installed version 2.0, you can locate the file folders on your desktop and select them in the same manner. Left click on the first folder. If you have multiple folders, hold your control key and left click on the additional files or folders that you wish to copy. When they're all selected, right click and select copy again, and then go back to your C drive, locate your super tech folder, locate your generations folder, and find a blank spot and select right click and paste. You will be asked to replace files in the destination folder. You can select replace all files in the destination or you can select let me decide for each file. Once these folders or files are placed back into your generations version 2.0 system, you may need to reboot your computer to allow the system to see all of the new files.